Because you guys can see, I just took out the door right now. I got the uh, spare part and I got the original right here. You gotta remove it and replace it. Obviously, you guys see how uh, much damage it was. Now, I was gonna replace it along with the hood and the fender, but they were charging me a lot more money, right? The door, I got it uh, at a good price, actually. So make sure you head to Junkyards, you know, to get the spare parts. I got it about like $100. The whole thing right here, including the side mirror, right? Super cool, about $100, crazy. I'm actually, I'm not even sure. I got the receipt right here. I got the receipt right here. So to change it, as you see, I'm changing it. And I'm um, happy I got a new door, right? Yep, $140. That's crazy, right? $140 for that. Just the fender, they were charging me. So it was a good price. I got no door right now. Uh, I couldn't even drive it right now. See if it was probably the 2000s, you know? Pretty cool. Uh, I don't know if you guys see a TikTok, but I'll probably start swinging doors right here, right? Right? Without a door. Super cool. So I gotta fix it. It came out a lot cheaper. The hood it costs about a hundred dollars as well. So I could just change the hood once it comes in silver. Very cool, very nice. Not expensive. And uh, it's a quick fix to open, like I told you guys, right? But yeah, I ran over a curve. Here's the suspension. This new suspension worked very good. But yeah, here's the new suspension. I'm gonna tell you guys, I got it fixed. Pretty cool. So yeah, he's new suspension. I remember I told you guys got it fixed, pretty cool. So it runs, the wheel's not in the back no more, perfectly aligned wheel. But the problem is that I actually ran out of curve one day, right? So now it starts squeaking again. So that's a bad thing. It starts squeaking, and it's a very uh, bad noise. So what I'm gonna do is gonna switch it again, right? I'm gonna take it to get it fixed. I already got the suspension part, so it's gonna be quick fixer upper, and it's gonna be running good as new, right? The window is already gonna get fixed. The hood is quickly fixed, $100. And the bumper, I gotta wait for it, right? It might be 300, but I still have to wait for it. And if I get lucky enough to actually find it in the junkyard, if not, I'm gonna have to buy it um, brand new. It's gonna be like about 300, and then I'm cleaning myself, right? But so, but right now, I'm gonna show you guys how to actually install the door. And super excited, right? If you guys wondering what are all these wires for? Obviously, this is open the door. This is for uh, the, the window to come up and down. You gotta learn. So all you gotta do is push it back in. So all you gotta do is just install the thing the way it was, like all these little rubber things, and we'll be good to go, right? Cool. So I finally got it. Now this one issue, the hinges are off, fans, the hinges are off, so that means that this is gonna, it's not gonna close right at all again. But look at the difference compared to the old shell and now the new shell, right? Check it out, just has a little scratch right here. It's not even dented, just a little scratch, but the hinges are off, right? So I went to take it to a body shop. I tried to take it off the hinges, I wasn't able to. Um, obviously, you can tell it's a little bit off. Yeah, with the car accident, it was, it was pushed back. But I know for sure you can take out the hinges, so that's a good thing, right? So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take it to the body shop. We should just push it or it's probably choose the hinges. Who knows? If you actually use the hinges, I'll come and get it. But as for now, I guess we'll just have to go and close the door like this. 
and take it. You know, close the door, tie it up, and then take it. I got some little electrical rope right there, so that's what we're gonna use, right? So let me finish installing the wires right here and put in door panel, and, uh, and I'll give you guys a little update right now. There you have it, a new door. Oh, we got the little screw. All right, so we're all finished. Here's the door, very complete. It doesn't close. Look at the difference. We gotta fix the hinges. Now I try putting it up, but I'm just a whole man, so I can't do it. No, it's right there. I'm gonna put it up right now. Give me a second. Let's go in the mirror. I got it from the spare parts, right? Go get it. Drop on that one. Got it right here. Let's put it on right now. As you can see, it's a quick, it just, just turns, it's a circle. Let's put it on. And as soon as we put it on, it should get stuck. Where is the little thing? It should be. It's not like that. It says it's like this. All right, let's fix it up. Let's push it in. Let's push it in. All right, because we're not going to lock. Okie dokie. About to turn. Let's turn it around. There we go. There we go. Oh, not yet. Can we have it? I got to just clip it back on. And it should work. Now, this is a little loose because I didn't tie it up properly. Not bad. This is right here. It's a little bit sturdier. Check it out the difference. The light, the light is different, but guess what? We can always buy it later. It costs like 60 bucks on eBay, I think. You can buy it. This is pretty fancy. It lights up, so it's pretty cool. That one doesn't. I mean, it doesn't matter. I'm really tired. I, it, I can't switch it. It's broken either way. Look there. I'm just been the broke, breaking it even more. You see that? So I'll just buy it off of eBay, and it's all broken. Check out the mirror. See, you see. The window's right there. All the parts are right here. The regular is right there as well, as well as the speaker. But uh, everything's supposed to be good. You can see the big difference. Everything's very nice and, and good. And this one, it has that little crash right there, right? Now, I was gonna pay about like $500 to $1,000 just to get it fixed, and it still wasn't gonna be perfect along with the hood. But now with $100, I already got this one fixed, $100 with the hood, and I already got the fender, right? So it's pretty good. So happy about it. Little fix it over, like you said, we're in progress. And we got major uh, fix, uh, major part right now upgrade, upgraded, which is a door. We're gonna check if it works right now. And for sure, we're gonna, we're gonna fix the hinges later on, right? But then we're gonna take it to an auto body shop because I can't take it off. They'll probably have to pry it off. I'm not really sure. But we're gonna go there and ask. And at least we already know this is a good fit for the door, right? It has to be a good fit. If it's not a good fit, then unfortunately, I'm gonna have to go get another door. But as of now, it works, right? Alright, so let's turn on the car. Everything's good. There's the door. We're gonna check it out. That's left, that's right. And we're gonna move the mirrors. Oh, the mirrors move, right? Very good, right? Let's check out the window. Alright. Uh oh. Oh, damn, what happened here? There you go. What's going on here? It might be too dirty. It might be too dirty. Ah, oh, damn, it might be too dirty after all. There we go. Damn, that's all that goes down? That's not right. That is not right. Might be dirty. This is the one that's dirty, so we're gonna change it, right? But there you go, there you go, it works. We're gonna fix it, and we're gonna tie it up with a rope right now, so that's what we're gonna take off for today, right? 